Hello friends, welcome to Access Zombie Code. Today we are going to create a login form by using Angular. So how it will be work, I will show you. This project I already created. I will show you how this will work. In this project, I use the Angular material. So here is the sign in page. In this sign in page, there are two fields. One is username, one, another one is password. And there is a button called sign in. In sign up, there are four fields one is username, email ID, password, and designation. Then a button to register or save the fields data so this is a simple form we have to create so let's start the program This is the second video of Angular series. So I give the name Angular 2 and the project is login form. By default, the routing is enabled for this project. So I select yes and my style is CSS. So I select the style sheet. After create the project, I will open that project in VS Code IDE. I will select the folder path and open the VS Code. I split the terminal where one is execute the server and another one is where I can write the command. Currently, the dummy program is executed on the server. As we know, we are going to use the Angular material. So, in the Angular material, there is a command to add the Angular material in our project. So, the command is ng add at the red angular material Angular material 
is added first i want to remove all the dummy code the dummy code are present in the app dot component html file after removing all the default code was removed and the view is blocked i want a navbar like this for navbar i go to component there is a option called toolbar copy the add into your angular page so here these are showing some error because we are not at the angular module in our module file i import the angular material in this project so the error is removed now i want to change accordingly as per my requirement here i add the my my channel name and the tooling where i want to navigate from from the navbar so i have to create two component for register and sign in to generate a component the code is i create two component one is register and another one is sign in so i have to set up the routing the syntax is path the path is blank then the page is redirect to sign in if the path is ending with sign in then it will component called sign in component so here i will add the component so i set the routing for both component let's check so both was working good 
to for the sign in page we required two input field and one button and one card so i will took all the things from here you can take the card from here for the input field you can take this input field and for the button you can choose any one of them as per your suitable so let's do that So after add the HTML in in the register, it will show like this. And in the sign in page, I add the sign in details like username and password so the page is ready